for being here today. I wasn't able to get a video ready like I was hoping for because I have been gone away from the fairy cottage for over a week. So I didn't make much progress actually. So I think I'm just gonna really wing this one. What I, uh, my mom and I actually came up with this idea and it is a thing because you know like when you get so creative and then you think, oh my gosh, I'm just having to do the strangest things in order to move forward with my so vision. So what I'm going to do is, now here I have all my, my little decorative pieces that are gonna tie in the look, but underneath here, and this also is a vintage gold, um, bedspread actually. So underneath here I have put the storage bins. They lock together and on top of this a little bench that I <laughs> that I can sit on and um, yeah like it's really quite comfortable. Coming up next with the Fairy Cottage renovation is major construction is going to be happening. We are getting a new fence, fixing this fence. It got blown down in the store. Another thing, a tractor is going to be coming and preparing the backyard, leveling it out. And so with this major construction coming up next week, it is holding me back from moving forward anymore on the, um, the patio the Juliet of the Spirits patio area. So I did put, I set out some of my things there just because I can't take it anymore. Like I, I want to enjoy the patio. <laughs> I started um, experimenting with replanting the geraniums. down at my mom's house, which I'm going to bring up here. They're pink, one out front that is red. I think from my little bit of research, it shouldn't be in the direct sun like that. So I think it needs a little bit more shade. It's so it's really um, blossoming or blooming. So anyway, um, 
that's what's coming up. So sit back, relax, and enjoy this video that I almost didn't get a video up, but I am posting a video <laughs> after all. So yes, enjoy the nice music I'm going to put with the beautiful sceneries in at the Sunken Garden. They're beautiful statues which will be reminiscent of me bringing Dancer here to the fairy cottage to set in the area which is Julia of the Spirits area. I think it'll be just romantic and perfect. The statue Dancer is now in two pieces. The top part of her that was completely shattered in an earthquake. She used to sit in Bel Air at Elizabeth Taylor's estate where Elizabeth Taylor had her beautiful gardens. So the statue sat at the bottom entrance of her driveway. It was given to my dear friend David North after it was shattered and he took these two pieces and then he gifted it to me. Dancer by Antonio Canova, dated 1809 to 1812. Thank you.